you guys know what this is this is what is called the paperclip test I'm doing it without the paperclip I'm using a, a bit of speaker wire hello everyone and welcome to crap what is today uh, Wednesday yeah Wednesday you guys remember the last vlog I talked about this thing popping well practically exploding um, just without outside damage and um, I did the paperclip test yesterday with a paperclip but I wasn't sure whether or not it would work with um, with what I was trying to do but I used a speaker wire this time where did I put it right here um, I used a speaker wire this time uh, and it d does not work uh, it should it should work if if the PSU did work and if the PSU did work then it would work with this and I've tried practically every socket on this thing and nothing happens so yeah I'm, I'm pretty sure the PSU is the problem however there is one thing I'm worried about it's possible that when the PSU popped that the uh, motherboard was shorted out it's possible it's possible um, I'm hoping seriously seriously hoping that that's not the case hello Zelda I'm seriously hoping that that's not the case but <laughs> case get it okay, uh, okay. Um, <laughs> I'm seriously hoping that's not the case so that I don't have to send the motherboard back in possibly buy another one or whatever but one way or another I'm gonna get this computer built I'm determined at this point to get this up and running and working well good um, one thing I did figure out, figure out though just tinkering out around with it a couple minutes ago uh, these two cords right here well technically one cord um, they go to the fans inside here these two fans I'm not sure if you can see that. Um, and I didn't know what exactly uh, what exactly they plugged into. They plugged into a little plug right here. Might be able to see that just barely. It says um, Case Fan 2. C H A Fan 2. And I'm guessing that's like chassis fan 2. So uh, while that one's plugged in via one of the. There's the cord it's plugged in via one of these, uh, which I it's not currently plugged in by the way, uh, because this sucks. Um, these need to be plugged in right here, so that they can run air through through here, uh, gather up air here, then be pushed out by then the air be pushed out by this big fan right here. So at least I figured that much out. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today. Um, Short vlog, just talking about the computer again. This kind of sucks. <laughs> I've seriously been worried all day, just just worrying about this whole computer problem. It's it's really stressing me out, but it's gonna happen, one way or another. It's gonna happen. Thank you all so much for watching, and until tomorrow, I'll see you all later. Also, this may be premature. But I'm reading an a online review of this of this particular UP, uh, U, not UPS, uh, PSU, and says um, they also issued a prepaid US uh, UPS label for the return shipping since the unit was only a few days old. Before that, it says I contacted Corsair and they sent me a brand new replacement PSU. That quite possibly means. That I will get a replacement P PSU regardless because I've only had it for a few days. That's awesome. <laughs> and that seriously, seriously takes a load off my mind.